From the creator of Squirrel Stapler, it's The Pony Factory. Winston arrived at a solution to the moral decay of his town. He called out to Hell in a secret candlelit room one evening and Hell answered him. A human body could, Hell promised, be twisted, stretched and broken into a kinder, more equine shape. Equine or equine? I can't read, the human heart molded into something less dot 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 human dot dot dot. Winston's town, now filled with the cruel and the ignorant, could instead be filled with magic ponies if he could provide a factory in which to make them. Winston thought they could be beautiful, gentle, and good. Hell had other plans. Use Wazda to move, okay. Use Crouch to Crouch. No Crouch necessary, all right. Winston from Overwatch? No, it's probably not him. TF2 Demo Man Gun, it's a good gun. The Maximalist Automatic Bolt Gun. Traditionally, it's a bolt, okay, it's a bolt gun, gotcha. That's a very loud bolt gun, holy crap. Quit to menu? No, don't quit to menu. Let's just go ahead and turn the volume on the bolt gun. Oh, I can, oh, oh, we can do FOV gaming. I do like FOV gaming, but some people do get motion sick from FOV gaming. Okay, that's a little bit better. It's quieter. Locked? Come on. What a rip off. Oh, but here, a monster. Are you one of these preposterous ponies that is made beautiful? Look for the unlocked door to complete each area. Okay. Are you unlocked? Yes. Can you be hop? There's no jumping on, oh, man. R to reload, look out for ammo pickups. They say ammo on them, okay. How do I get it? E? Does it just automatically activate when I'm... Hmm. Enemy pony spotted. Very tanky. Is it headshot only, maybe? Maybe it's only headshot. That could be it. I want to shoot this. Looks like a target. It wasn't a target, but it was worth it. We've identified a number of minor leaks in the liquid lightning holding tanks. Please use the utmost care. Okay. Use shift to walk slowly. I just go up here. Oh, you can't jump. Utmost care. Utmost. I'm utmost. Weird tank. Guess I go around the weird tank. This is very harrowing with a high FOV. I guess this is a safe spot right here. The edge definitely isn't safe, so I guess this is safe. Ooh. That was spooky. I like how the gun has lights on it, that's cool. That's a neat feature. Pick up med kits. Not you, I need a medkit. I need a medkit. You are dead. Press use to load last save. Okay. Let's not die to the first pony this time. Maybe I can... Is it a headshot? Is it the headshot rule? Okay, he died that time. Did a little bit better. Got 80 health now. What in the alone in the dark sewer level is this? Yeah, really. And that's a level that'll zap your socks off. That new alone in the dark they're making looks uh looks okay. It looks like a 6.5 slash 7 out of 10 video game, which is a perfectly fine video game. It doesn't look like it's gonna be amazing, but it does look good. Just like Alone in the Dark on Xbox 360. That game sucks, but that game is amazing. Like, it's not good, but holy crap, that game is so good. That's a great game. All right, where is this med kit you keep telling me about? I keep saying use the med kit. I don't see one, though. Reload, reload. Where's my ammo? Leave. Med kit, med kit. All right, there we go, that's good. Locked. Stupid pony. We need the coat inventory. Yeah, the coat inventory was a revolutionary feature of that game. 
Do I gotta hit use on it? Hit E on the ammo, maybe? No. I'll kill this guy, then I'll see how much ammo I have left. Can I have the ammo now? Oh, okay, it's a little circle guy. It's not the box that says ammo. It's the circle on top of the box. Gotcha. I do got that drum mag. So now I should have enough bullets to kill this guy. All right, bring it on. Do your worst. Nice, no damage at all. If the sins outside became so great and so numerous as to evoke the wrath of God, the precarious death pit can be jumped into to ensure a quick and fatal escape from divine retribution. Oh, okay, that's pretty good. Precarious death pit sounds pretty good to me. Does that count as the exit? Did I go this way yet? Oh, maybe the precarious death pit's a checkpoint. Are you a checkpoint precarious death pit? No, it just killed me. Okay. Well, it definitely is a precarious death pit. They weren't lying. It has a little bit of stun lock, but like not that much. I like the gun model. The gun model is very cool. I'm a big fan. I'm a sucker for a drum mag. What can I say? Call me an Al Capone. Right, give me your medicine. Thank you very much. Now I'll face down the other one. Who was around this corner? Yeah. He's out of there. Rip Bozo. Any more? Can I have the flashlight? Aha. Press right mouse. Okay. Oh my god, it's a pony. It did kind of look like a guy. It was like guy shaped when it was like bent over like that. You can backtrack and search for ammo and health. Okay. I'm assuming that means there will be ammo and health back here in the dark room. Eh, I'll be fine. Unless health persists between levels and I won't be fine. But if it doesn't, then I'm good. Where's the gun? You're out of there. Reload. Gotta stay topped off. Okay, looks like the health does persist between levels, I think, so that's not good. That's bad. It did say backtrack. Does that mean I can go to previous rooms? Uh-oh. You are dead. Yeah, the health does persist between rooms. Okay, not good. That's not ideal. But once you learn the enemy spawns, you can kind of get the upper hand on them. You have a medkit shelf? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Now I have some decent health. Feeling a little bit better. Oh. That was sooner than expected. Oh, so that's a guy. That's an imp. He's throwing the fireball at me. Okay, they got range, guys. They're not all melee monsters. They know how to throw a fireball. Which way? Let's go right first. Medkit? Medkit, yeah, there we go. Delicious. My favorite. Nope. 
Hello, deadly shotgun. Thank you for subscribing. I wish this game had a deadly shotgun. Maybe it's got more guns. I will try to answer many questions. Our company is evil. Okay. There he is. Oh, is that two of them? Uh-oh. We got a double. We got a McDouble in the neighborhood. All right, 40 health? Okay, not bad. I'm still going. Any med kit on these shelves? I wish that I could find a med kit on the shelf. Oh, it's a fireball and runner, guys? Oh, man. Oh, man. And a weird alien sound effect. Okay, he's down. Are you a note? I am well aware of how insane this sounds, but the squirrels want to destroy the facility. All the squirrels. It's the squirrels again. The squirrels from the squirrel stapler have returned. Maybe. If you fully read the lore, the story will become clear. Fire in burst to maintain accuracy or get up close. Okay, so it sucks at a distance. Oh, he's shooting at me. Okay, a long range battle. Did he die? Nope, he's still up. Oh, there's more. A devious trap. Oh man, this requires skill. Ouch. I think I got one of them though, I think we traded. I believe there's one more guy. Did I get both of them? I might have got both. I know this job can be repetitive, so when you get bored, remember the four plus one plus four trick. Alrighty. You're watching Theremin Gaming. Mm -hmm. What is this, Scribble Knots? My fellow creators, in just one month, the Pony Maker will be ready to go. Okay. Why does it make it make a bottle sound? That's weird. You think it would make a band aid sound? Like a little bandage wrap sound effect, like Left 4 Dead style? I hate you. You made me download Twitch. I didn't make you do anything. If you want to come watch Oboe Shoes Games play the Steam new releases page every day, finding the best and worst of what it has to offer, that's on you. Mostly it's the worst. Be gone. I'm pretty sure this game was already released like a long time ago as part of like some other thing. I think the Steam release of this is recent, but it's not like, oh man. The Steam release of this is recent, but it's not like a brand new game. Please aim the gun. There we go. 10 health. That's not enough health. That's just enough health to fail the next room. And three bullets. Yeah, I'm done. There's no chance. Is there like a restart button? Okay, only 40 health. I gotta get good. Use the backtrack method. Gotta back him into the hallway. Is he de -aggroed? No, he aggroed. Isaac Mo 43, thank you for subscribing. You can be Isaac Dead Space. A famous character. Ow, he got me good.
Aha, uh -huh, more ammo hiding down there. We ever go back to emulate, I mean, legally purchasing old video games and playing those? Yeah, I will. I played most of the Xbox 360 and PS3 era bad shooters, which is where my interests lie. To play like a like PS2 slash PS1 slash original Xbox era stuff. I'm going to play a bunch of that stuff too, but I have a bit of a different format in mind for that. Than just funny gamer moments. Working on that one. That one's cooking in the background. Soon to be revealed. Ow. You caught me monologuing. I got syndromed. Yeah, he's going pretty good. Got 35 health left. I was going for the melee. All right, 35 health, 19 hearts. Not ideal. Now the health is ideal, but the ammo is still not ideal. Okay, the health is fine now. Now the health is good. It's just 19 shots. That's not that many shots. No one ever died from having too much ammo. Use cover to avoid projectile damage. Was there a dog guy? Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Does this do anything? And no bullets. Can you last of us me some bullets, please? Can you dynamically spawn some bullets in because the player needs one? Or am I out of luck? There might have been some on that shelf up there. Maybe if I bait him into the boiler room, I can, like, run around him. Ow. Okay, so I think it's just the... Crap. Bullets. I think it's a hit scan projectile. Crap reload. Whew. Needs a flashlight melee? Yeah, that'd be useful. The electric grid and the shooter guys? You gotta be joking. One down. Good hit, Hunter 2-1. Multiple KIA bogeys. Oh, he's coming. He's coming in close. Crap. Oh, that was bad. I got corridored. No ammo again. Is there a difficulty slider for this? I have nine shots. I had to reload. I have some ammo. Is it enough? No. Don't do it. Don't shoot me. I just need bullets. Give me some rounds. There we go. Got some bullets. I got bullets. It's possible. Where'd he go? This requires clutch gaming. There we go. Okay. Med kit? Any medicine at all? Hello? Suppose not. That should be end of level though, right? Yeah. Cap Seacher, thank you for subscribing. The theremin music is giving the game an interesting vibe. Yeah, I like it. I like it when it goes... It's a good sound effect. Because a lot of times with like a, like a grungy horror game, it just goes like... This has like evil sounds in the background. You are dead. Am I gonna be able to beat this with just five health? Hmm. Hmm. It's like one hit will kill me here.
Okay. Med kit. You know it's survival horror when you always want a med kit. When every two seconds you're like, where's the med kit, man? Give me that med kit. That's how you know you're playing survival horror. That's how it's done. I know this hallway dog is here now. There we go. Gave him a taste of his own medicine. I think you're a guy. Oh, here we go. This is a bad hallway to get stuck in. Oh, no. Oh, God. Like the boar hallway from Dark Souls 1, yeah. Really need a med kit big time. Perhaps a medkit is on this perch for me. There's an ammo. Not exactly what we were looking for. Right, where's this guy at? I gotta kill him. Ooh, okay, there we go. I backed off on him. Medkit, ooh, yes. Now I'm surviving that horror. This horror is getting survived. Spoke too soon. Keta Monster, thank you for subscribing. Elite gamer skills. Oh, yeah, you know it. Only the most skilled gamers can navigate the square hallways. I hear another guy. I don't want to go searching for resources yet because that guy is still out there somewhere. Where'd he go? Is he up there? Oh, he's behind the generator. Okay. He vanished. Hmm, he's in a tough spot. Oh, he's stuck. He's stuck. Yeah. Get stuck, AI. Take that, NPC. This is why chat GPT will never replace humans. Just top off the old bullets. There's got to be more of them around here somewhere. It can't just be a fake out room, can it? Medkit? No medkit, so sad. I hate stairways like these in video games. These stairways are not good for shooters. Okay, we got an evil light. That's good. Oh man, I descended big time. It's gonna be a boss. I'm not ready for a boss encounter. Is it a med kit? That's a note. Lore moment. What do you want, lore? I have received your concerns. As you know, there is a lot of excess sin. I am sure that our work, making the company as evil as possible, will not backfire. Are you the end? Nope. I'm scared because the checkpoint is so far away. The beginning of this mission is like forever ago. I only have 30 health. Hmm. Let me explore the giant room. 
I didn't go over here yet. What's over here? Med kit. Medical kit. Kit of medical supplies. No such luck. Oh my god, Tony8987 with the super duper Twitch gift. Hang on. Let me try to finish this tense puzzle maze. I gotta kill this guy first. Okay, he's right there. Oh, he's coming for me. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come on. There he is. He keeps vanishing. There we go. Okay. That used way too much ammo. Not good. But here's a lot of ammo. Thank you, game. Okay, so it's a gun upgrade, I guess. The attachment allows the bolt gun to fire faster the longer the trigger is held. Ooh. That sounds good. That sounds like the most fun indeed. I use ad block, so here's a year's worth of ad revenue. Yes, thanks. Thank you for the gift subs, Tony. Honestly, you didn't have to go with 10. You could just go with 1. Literally one Twitch sub is more ad revenue than you would ever hope to generate in one lifetime watching a streamer. Crap. My health, my health. If you Twitch subscribe to a streamer one time in your entire life, then you never have to feel guilty about ad blocking ever again on like the entirety of the Twitch website. Implying people feel guilty about ad blocking in the first place, I don't. I got YouTube ad revenue, but I still ad block, and I suggest you do the same, because ads suck. Hmm. It probably gave me a good gun because I got to fight the huge monster, right? Debt repaid, yeah. Bring us to Twitch subscription and wipe away the debt. Any peripheral med kits or ammo I should be aware of? Or is it just an ominous room? YouTube Premium for the win, yeah. YouTube Premium's okay. It costs a little bit too much for what it does, I think, but it's alright. I don't have it. Well, here we go. Ah, uh, it was a fake out room. It was a fake stocking up on ammo room because there is no ammo to stock up on. Hmm. The old red boiler room, eh? I'm not used to seeing a different color besides black and white. Oh, here we go. It's worth it for the YouTube red originals. Mm-hmm. I heard Cobra Kai was pretty good. That Vsauce one was probably pretty good, but he just ended up posting that for free after the YouTube Red Originals died. I watched like one episode and I was like, yeah, I'm glad I didn't pay for this. It's okay, but meh. Over the coming week, I will be installing Magical Friendship Energy. Nice. Are you going to come to life? One of them's alive, right? No? The thing you seek lies at the heart of the pony maker. Huh. Med kits? The heart of the pony maker has med kits in it? Oh my god. Here we go. That should have crushed me. Come on, that should have gone. Maybe it's the ending of the game. The ponies. They've all gone mad. This is not magical friendship energy from the depths of hell itself at all. It is pure sin from the depths of hell itself. Twisted to resemble wonder and whimsy. Oh my god, wonder and whimsy betrayed us? How could the hell betray us like this? 
Oh no, they are coming. No, no. Ag. Ag. Winston, the CEO. Like how he signed it. That's pretty good. This is what you've been searching for. Nice. Okay. You have found what you came for. Now escape. Simple enough. Did you change? No. Nah. Am I backtracking the whole game? Is that what we're doing now? I watched PewDiePie's show. PewDiePie had a show on YouTube Red. I mean, it's not surprising. I'm sure he did. He was like the biggest guy, so of course he had one. But what could that have even been? The real Dark Souls begins now, yeah. dead. I hate when they run up to you. It ruins my aim ability. Is there going to be like a left for dead? That one campaign where when you backtrack all the resources you already used are gone. Like is there going to be no med kits for the rest of this? That would be annoying. Where'd that guy go? Ah, down there. Come on, spawn me a med kit. You know you want to. Med kit underneath the steps, maybe? Nope, no big spot though. That's where I would have put one if I was Robert, game developer. But I'm not. There we go. Is there a quick save? There is no quick save. It's survival horror. You can't quick save for survival horror. You gotta get to the checkpoint. Alright, barrel, come on. Meg, hit me up. Ammo. This room wasn't green last time I was here, I think. Oh, dog. He Did he turn into a dog guy? Or is it a dog guy and a caster? Might be a dog guy and a caster at the same time. Because so far, the casters haven't been able to turn into the dog guys. So I don't think that's what happened there. Found you through old Borderlands playthroughs. Nice. The old Borderlands content. Every once in a while, somebody comments in the Borderlands content and goes, uh, actually, you can farm a gun there. I'm like, ah, oh, thanks. I'll be sure to tell me from three years ago that information. I keep forgetting I already got that note. That note is no longer notable. Uh, can I get this notarized? Here we go. I found you from Bannerlord Faction Guide. Yeah, on the Bannerlord Faction Guide video, people love posting the entire story of their playthrough. They'll be like, really? You thought that X Faction was this? In my playthrough, that's like five paragraphs. People can't resist. It's the kind of game that makes you want to tell somebody about it, and when nobody will listen, you gotta resort to YouTube comments. I've been there. I understand. Okay, not bad. Med kit. Med kit. If I keep saying med kit, maybe it'll oh summon one into existence. Crap. I'm dead. Ten health. I found you through Bionicle Mods vid. Nice. That's the best one. That's the one you want people to find you through. You want people to know me as the Bionicles guy. That's what I want. You seen that guy that plays all those really bad Steam games? Oh, the Bionicles guy? Oh, that was close. My goal is to become Kopaka. 
I'm not enjoying the 10 health aspect of this. This is very annoying. One aspect I would enjoy is a medkit aspect. But I don't think any of these shelves have one. They got so much ammo, though. Enough ammo to fill a swimming pool. I found you through the Baby Yoda Wants to Kill You video. A great video. One of the best talking JPEG videos ever. Medkit! My precious. Come on, take him down. What? That was through the wall. That was through the wall gaming. Reveal yourself, Spectre. Where'd he go? This is a very Dark Souls-esque encounter right here. Stand still. There we go. There was an ammo I couldn't get before because I was all full. Well, I'm not full anymore. But now I'm full again. Okay, I hear more. I hear more of those things. Is it a dog of those things or a running of those things? I'm not sure. I can't tell by the sound. Oh, it's a dog. Okay. Be gone, those things. That's the second time I used that room's geometry to my advantage, I think. Now that's gaming. Oh. What? Boo! Boo! That sucks. That sucks. Did it just spawn that guy behind me? Was he lying in wait? Where was that guy? That was super lame. Reascend the staircase. I got the stairman. Get ready for these bozos. Crap. Should have been ready. I wasn't ready. I forgot there was a running guy there. All right, first you. He's down. Grab his ammo. Reload the old rifle. Hit the stair guy. Why did he come down? I don't like that he came down. That was uh, concerning. Now bait the dog. There we go. Bait the doggo. He still got down. Come on. Oh, and you're gonna you. <sighs> Getting a little bit annoyed. Can I have a checkpoint, please? Where's baby mode? It said casual on the options menu. Not options menu. The, the main title page had like a difficulty selector, but I didn't pick one. So it's probably on normal. It's on normal difficulty. Whatever the developer's intention was is what I'm playing it on. The developer intended me to die. 
It's just a skill issue, though. If I had more health, wouldn't be a problem. There we go. That's huge. That's huge. That was a good run. Now, if I remember correctly, there's nothing else. Nope, there's that guy. My memory don't work. Hmm, that cost me like 10 health. That was bad. There's guys there too? What? I was behind the corner. I guess I wasn't because I saw him. I guess if I can see him, he can see me. I didn't remember how many guys were there. At least that guy is easy. Because that guy sucks. I wish a checkpoint would put me after the stairs, though. That'd be nice. That'd reduce some of the tedium. I beat doors, though. If I can beat doors, I can beat this. Doors was much more difficult than this. World's number one door is gamer right here. I guess he's not aggroed. What was that? He just came sprinting towards me. Doors had more frequent checkpoints. Yeah, there was a checkpoint every two seconds in doors. The only problem was it took one second to die, so it was a problem. There's two guys in that corridor. I did not remember that. That's news to me. All right, top me off big time. Plenty of rounds. Here's the med kit. I think I'll take that. Thank you very much. Now this guy. I hate this guy. This guy sucks. And where was that third dog that got me? I gotta locate him, too. There he is. Come on out, Flint. What hurt me? The dog? Did the dog melee me, maybe? This is melee transcend verticality. Nope. Ah. Okay, there was a door back there. There's a door back there that I think the dog probably came through. I didn't check my corners. Big mistake. There he is. Come on up. I didn't actually mean come on up. Oh my god. I meant come on up into my line of fire and die, not come on up and punch me. Time for escape, yep. Time to escape the realm again. He almost got me that time. He almost charged me up. Deal with the likes of you. Let's deal with the likes of you. That's huge. That's huge. Literally everything is huge right now. Nothing is small. Of great stature and import is all these plays I'm making. Nice. Nice. Okay, looking pretty good right now. 
said the hubris gamer. I'm about to get hubris. There's the running guy. Okay, good. He's actually shooting now. I like when his combat AI is active. Come on, he's so low. He's gotta be low, right? Come on back. Oh, come on. There he is, get him. There we go, okay. This encounter is very annoying. There we go. All right, now for the guy down there. I can't forget about him. Hope I can kill him this time. Aggro and shoot. There we go, no damage, nice. Whew. A close call. And no med kit. No med kit to be found. Hello? Uh, guys? Does anyone have a m -m 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 med kit for me? Again, ammo. So much ammo. There's a med kit, but it's a trap, right? No trick? Oh, double med kit. You're too kind, game. That's the problem, though. You're too kind. Don't fall for it. Ah! Huh. Thank you, med kit. Hmm, locked up. I don't trust this long corridor. Come on, where's the bad guys? I'm getting tensioned now. Checkpoint? Ooh, checkpoint. I like that. I'm a fan. Don't mind me, electric puddles. Oh, boy. Oh, the theremin's back. You know it's serious when the theremin has returned. Oh, look, the light of day. That's good. There is hope for this decrepit factory after all. Oh, there's two of you guys? That's not good. That's not in my operations playbook. My operations playbook is one page long. It says how to kill one guy. Oh, there we go. Ooh, thank God. It's being generous with medkits now. That one stretch of the game was mildly challenging, but fortunately, no more. I've had my fill of challenging gameplay. Or have I? The worst could be yet to come. This room again. I should've known. You wanna dance? Where do you go? Oh, we came all the way up here? Wow. For little old me. Sometimes up for a challenge, yes, yeah, sometimes. Sometimes I'm up for a challenge. Hello, ammo. Another med kit down there? Nice. Maybe the med kits are here to facilitate speed runners. Boys, because there's lots of guys down there. Because the odds of you taking damage here are very high. I don't like this. I don't like this. Whew. All right, I'm nice and medicinal. Did I get the ammo on top of that barrel? I don't remember. I think I did. 
Better sorry than safe. Yeah, I got it. I'm so sorry. Sounds like a halo shield recharging sound in the background. Avoid the light of day at all costs. That's how they get you. I got two shots, I got no bullets now. Now I'm in a bullet issue. There we go, thank God. Thank God for ammo. Dog. Bad dog. Oh, there's two. Oh my god. No. No. I've come so far. Why well, I really feasted on those med kits and I paid the price. Now I'm back down to survival horror levels of health and ammo. Highs and lows. Talks about peaks and valleys. Are you clipping into the bucket, small notes? Yeah, you are. Hmm. Hmm. Blue room? That's a new color. What's a blue room do? My name is Jonas! Yeah, that's what I thought. How about this? I want to... Mm hmm The world ha... Ooh, we... All right, I'm done. Should I do the whole album? Now I'll do four. Four is enough. Oh, red. I'm not doing any red. That's not happening. Red is the State Farm song. You fool. You thought the shelf would be porous? You thought I had ammo? You were wrong. Kill him. Ah! Hmm, not good. Not a good spot. I will flee on foot. Health and ammo. Health and ammo. Health. The ammo is the issue now, though. I guess I just go for it. So many round things that look like ammo but aren't ammo. Fake ammo. No, I can't get past a dog though, dang it. I can outrun the other guy but not the dog guy. I can't fool him. Go, go, go. He has to pause to swing, so maybe I can run out enough to escape. Let me win, let me win, let me win, let me win, let me win. Hey, there we go. Still no bullets, but you know, now I got some. Thank God these demons can't open a locked door. Hmm, the old puddle room again. Crap. That was slow reaction time. That was grandpa gaming. Time to put old oboe in the home. Another red room, eh? It's a dog eat dog world. Maybe it's a secret ending. Maybe the pit's like an ending now. Maybe the ending is jump in the pit. Maybe I can't leave and it says go in the pit to win. That could be it. Still locked. That was bad. My lack of caution will surely see me slain. Any more? Anyone else want some? Yep. Not surprising. Yeah, you just knew. You just knew when the electric puddle was coming out there was going to be enemies during the electric puddles later. You just knew that was going to happen.
Okay. That's how it's gonna be, eh? Crap. There's always another one. Just when you think you're safe. That's when they get you. Mm -hmm. The obvious medkit trap. Thank you years of gaming experience for saving me from that one. I have years of gaming experience. Check out my gamer resume. Uh, I don't see any achievements for beating a game on a normal difficulty or higher. Don't you have at least one achievement for, like, beating the game on normal? What? Uh, I think you'll find my literal hundreds of casual completions to be more than adequate. Oh, crap, that small pillar did not block it. Didn't block it. Twenty health and fifteen shots. If I am slain, twas all for naught. Give me some rounds, give me some rounds, give me some rounds, give me some rounds. You have crybabies 100%, I do. I have crybabies in the magic tiers 100%. Few can say the same. Actually, that's not even true. I had the achievements 100%, but I did not 100% that game. I didn't three star all the mini games. I'm a fake, fake crybabies gamer. Is it just me or is this getting kind of labyrinthine? Which way is the right way? I can't be certain. Is it you? Hey, there we go. This seems like a new room. Is this new? Who did that? Didn't even see the guy. Oh, it's him. Should have known it was the likes of you. This seems like a boss will spawn. Did I get him? Nope. There we go. I have all the achievements in Cry Babies Imperial. Can you say the same? Justice! <laughs> Death to the Cry Babies. Oh my god. Cry babies, you've thrown Skyrim into chaos, and now the Empire is going to put you in nap time. There's the boss, there he is. Hello, giant headman. That's not good. Okay, what's my tactic for this guy? I guess just hide behind one of these walls and hope for the best. First, I gotta get rid of this guy over here. He'll cause problems if left unchecked. Bring it on, boss. Is he stuck? Did I win? I might have won. I think I won. I think I did it. Oh, he's turning. That's not good. He's turning. Stay over there. Oh, he's coming forth. Crap. Get slain. Get slain, foul creature of darkness. Where'd he go? What, can you shoot fireballs? There he is. Come on, so close, maybe. Maybe I'm so close, I have no idea, actually.
Maybe I just go to the lightning bolt? Oh, come on. Sounds like the intro to Dexter's Lab, yeah. They got real sci-fi there. Because there's a little lightning bolt where he spawns. Maybe you can't kill him and you have to go to the lightning bolt, but that's definitely not it because it gives you a million ammo. It wouldn't top you off if you weren't meant to shoot him. Can I glitch him again, though? It worked last time. Okay, this does work. Never mind. I redact my previous statement. Where'd he go? Oh, he's back in the blue part, okay. Show yourself, foul creature. He's all the way back there, what the heck? I mean, I'll take it. Crap. He wasn't truly trapped. And where'd you go, buddy? There he is, back by the blue again. He likes the blue walls. He's a blue wall enjoyer. Yeah, I did it, okay. Bow vanquished. So now I just gotta go in here and then I win. Oh, the light of day, feels so good to look up to that static skyline. I gotta go back inside, come on. Oh, the man smiled as he walked through the abandoned parking lot away from the pony factory. He'd found and stolen the source of the pony magic and escaped with his life. He'd done what others thought impossible, and now he would succeed where his father failed. With the power of hell at his fingertips, he would create his own pony army, far larger and greater. All he needed were victims to transform in a factory in which to do it. Hell had planned all this and had smiled in anticipation of what was to come. That was the pony factory. It was pretty good. A solid gameplay experience by David Szymanski. I'm sorry, David. I don't know how to say your name, but good game, though. <laughs>